Mark Benito from WP Academy here to show you how to make a blog roll button, also known as an RSS feed button, on a WordPress website. I'm also going to show you how to add other social media links to your website as to Twitter, LinkedIn, Facebook, etc. Let's get to it. So we're back on the WordPress Essentials for Business test site and I'm going to show you how to add a blog roll button to a WordPress website. Now a blog roll button is a list of links to external sites that you like, particularly external blogs. And it normally goes on your sidebar. So let's add that blog roll button right above here where it says about our program on the right sidebar. You're going to go to the dashboard. Now you see this links button. This used to be done, this function used to be done with links. Links uh, has of WordPress 3.5 is now obsolete. In fact, new installations um, aren't even going to reveal that. What you're going to want to do instead is use a custom menu. So you're going to go under appearance menus. And this is the default navigation menu, but we're creating a different menu here, which is the blog roll button. So just click on this plus here to create a new a new menu and we're going to call this blog roll. Blog roll is remember it's sites that you like. You could call it anything you like like you know good resources. Create the menu and then we're going to create two custom links within that menu. One is the copy blogger site that I like and you're going to have to find that URL. I've gone to the copy blogger blog here. Copy that into my clipboard and paste into the custom link URL, add to menu. And let's say I also like HubSpot inbound marketing blog. So let's say HubSpot marketing. And here's that HubSpot inbound marketing blog. Just copy that URL, paste that into the custom link, add that to menu. You can reorder these by drag and drop, which is pretty cool. We're going to save the menu. And then you just have to add the custom menu widget to your sidebar. And this, of course, is done from the appearance widgets. And there's the custom menu there. And you're going to drag it to the top of your right sidebar. And I'm going to call it blog roll. And you're going to select the menu to display. And now when we refresh the site, there's that blog roll and the external links to the copy blogger and to the HubSpot marketing. Now if you wanted to add uh, social media links instead, there's many plugins that will add social media links to your site. There's follow me links and there's like links to separate categories, but you just have to Google WordPress social media plugin and you'll get a whole list of them and or WordPress social media plugin review. I hope that helps. Please check out other WP Academy quick tutorials on WordPress website design and small business web marketing.